Denny Medley USA Today Sports The interior of the Chiefs' offensive line has been a strength all season, with rookie Trey Smith taking on a leadership role in recent weeks. Playing beside a fellow rookie in center Creed Humphrey, the duo has dominated opposing defenses, especially in blocking their own game, as Kansas City looks to become more dynamic with a commitment to running the ball with Daryl Williams and Derek Gorn. Their efforts in creating a push for positive yards will be absolutely crucial to penetrating Green Bay's defensive front. Smith needs to play a clean game with no penalties to keep his unit on top in this one, and he could help first-year starting tackle Lucas Neon keep pressure off Patrick Mahomes for the full 60 minutes on Sunday. He has made a name for himself with the ferocity that's popped out on his film this year, and a big game against the Packers would keep Smith on an upward trajectory after a hot start. He registered his first sack of the season last week in the fourth quarter against New York, but Clark will need about nine more over the rest of the year to justify his massive cap hit. Clark has always been productive in spurts, but his most recent drought has been particularly hard to watch amid the Chiefs' defensive struggles. Packers quarterback Jordan Love will be making a meaningful start against professional pass rushers for the first time in his life. The Green Bay offensive line also isn't at full strength with David Bakhtiari still on the pup list. Clark will have a huge opportunity to take over and prove Kansas City's fans wrong about him. Brad Mills USA Today Sports It has been four weeks since Tyreek Hill broke triple digits in receiving yards, an unfortunate streak that is likely to come to an end against Green Bay.